648 now this morning. Get right to your news in a flash. The Dixon High School shooter will receive a sentence this October after pleading guilty to opening fire four years ago. Matthew Milby took a plea deal in court for aggravated discharge of a firearm in a school and that a police officer. The incident happening in 2018 with school resource officer Mark Dallas stopping Milby. And a Pecatonica police sergeant is free from jail this morning while facing charges related to sexual harassment. According to court documents, Jeffrey Stacy showed a nude photograph of himself to a woman last September. The same thing reportedly happened to two women back in March. Stacy is also accused of asking for sexual favors while on duty and in uniform. Meantime, a Rochelle man is sentenced to 18 years behind bars after being convicted as a child predator. Ogle County State's Attorney's Office says Vincent Swope committed crimes with a female minor between 2011 and 2012. Rochelle Police investigated the accusations in 2019. And happening now, one family is asking for the state line's help to find this missing elderly couple. Bonnie and Harold Hayes were last seen in Walnut Ridge, Arkansas on Tuesday. They reportedly told the bank teller they were headed to their daughter's house in Loves Park. The pair was driving a silver Ford Escape with Arkansas license plate 063 WPE. Meantime, a decade has now passed since the discovery of a dead newborn in Roscoe. Workers at a recycling plant found the newborn. Found the newborn. Investigators named him Noah. The baby's parents have never been identified. At least 90 infants have also been abandoned since the safe haven law took effect in Illinois. And across the nation, House Speaker Nancy Pelosi says a vote on abortion rights will likely take place today. The bill, originally introduced earlier this year, is known as the Women's Health Protection Act. It would stop states from imposing abortion restrictions that could make them more difficult and expensive. And looking ahead, new jobs in Ogle County. Loves is a truck stop and travel station. It's a new location that will sit off Interstate 39 and exit 111 on Route 72 in Monroe Center. It's open 24-7, also features a dog park and showers for truckers. A Godfather's Pizza and Subway open Monday. Travel stop means about 55 jobs. That's your news in a flash. Here's Savannah.